Welcome to Lynch's Pharmacy Film Studios. This video is on Calvapen antibiotic. Calvapen is phenoxymethyl penicillin and is a penicillin antibiotic. We take Calvapen, it's used to treat bacterial infections such as chest infections, tonsillitis, cellulitis, ear infections, dental abscesses. It is used in particular for respiratory infections in children. It works by killing the bacteria causing the infection. You may also be prescribed calvapin to prevent an infection from occurring if you are at particular risk of getting an infection. So how to take calvapin? You take calvapin first of all exactly as your doctor tells you to take it. It is usually taken four times daily. Your doctor or pharmacist will tell you how much to take and when to take it. And your dose will be on the, on the label of the pack to remind you. Space the doses out evenly during the day. You should take calvapin when your stomach is empty, which means taking it one hour before food or waiting until two hours after food. This is because your body absorbs less of the medicine after a meal, which means it is less effective. Even if your infection has cleared up, keep taking the calvapin until the course is finished, unless you are told to stop by your doctor. This is to prevent the infection from coming back. A course of treatment often lasts around seven days, although it may, may be longer than this. If you still feel unwell after finishing the course, go back to see your doctor. If you forget to take a dose, take one as soon as you remember. Try to take the correct number of doses each day, but do not take two doses at the same time to make up for a missed dose earlier. In order to get the best from your treatment, some people develop thrush, which is redness and itchiness in the mouth or vagina after taking a course of antibiotics. If this happens to you, speak with your doctor or pharmacist for advice. If you're using the combined oral contraception or the pill, additional contraceptive precautions such as condoms are not required during a course of this antibiotic unless you are sick, i.e. you vomit or have diarrhea. If you need further advice about this, speak with your doctor or pharmacist. This antibiotic may stop the oral typhoid vaccine from working. If you are having any vaccinations, make sure the person treating you knows that you are taking this medicine. So the main side effects of calvapin would be nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, diarrhea and a skin rash. It is okay to take it during pregnancy. It's not harmful, but you do not take it when breastfeeding. There is an interaction between calvapin and methotrexate, as penicillin reduces excretion of methotrexate, leading increased risk of toxicity. So again, talk to your doctor or pharmacist before taking it if you're on other medicine. Calvapin is a penicillin, so do not take it if you're allergic to penicillin. Again, talk to your GP or pharmacist if you have any worries about that. If you have any questions on Calvapin, you can contact me through the virtual pharmacist on the website, or you can email me through the website, or call into the pharmacy. Thank you.